Hello and welcome to English Through Experience. I'm ET Tutor. This is another quick revision video for Edexcel GCSE English Language students. It's for Paper 1 and Section A and this time we're looking at an extract from Jane Eyre. So, if you haven't already watched the videos where I look at Great Expectations, it'd be a good idea to look at those ones first because I go into more detail there than I'm going to do this time around. I'm making these ones for students who are doing the resits in November 2018, but obviously they're going to help any future students too. So, let's have a little look at question one. So we've got from lines five to ten, Identify the phrase which suggests the narrator is deeply affected by the nurse's criticism. One mark. So hopefully you're all aware that all you need to do here is find the phrase and copy it out exactly as it appears in the text. So let's look over at the text here on the right hand side. We've got line one, two, three, four, five. So it's from here, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I'm going to read this little section out and I want you to try and listen along, try to work out which part it is where the narrator is talking about their feelings, obviously, and that it's going to be a strong emotion because we've got deeply affected over here. So her feelings in relation to the nurse's criticism. Whew. I was glad of it. I never liked long walks, especially on chilly afternoons. Dreadful to me was the coming home in the raw twilight with knit fingers and toes and a heart saddened by the chidings of Bessie the nurse and humbled by the consciousness of my physical inferiority to Eliza, John and Georgiana Reed. The said Eliza, John and Georgiana were now clustered round their mamma in the drawing room. She lay reclined on a sofa by the fireside and with her darlings about her for... Okay, a abrupt ending as ever. So there we go, there we've got the little section. So, one of the things that you might do with this question is zoom in and see if you can find particular words. So that's another technique you can do. This question is supposed to be quite straightforward. That's why things like this work. So if we look for the word nurse within our section here, we can see that it falls just in the middle of the second paragraph. And then before it, we've got a heart saddened by the chidings of Bessie the nurse. Okay, so we know we've got a heart saddened. That's deeply affected. We've got the nurse. And if you know what the word chidings means, you'll be feeling really confident because it's kind of like ticking off, telling off. It's criticising somebody. So we've got the section there, a heart saddened by the chidings of Bessie the nurse. And that would be your one mark. Hopefully that one was nice and easy for you and you'll uh, feel confident to join me again for question two. Now the reading text is in the description box below like always with these ones and you can download the paper and the reading text from my website too so I'll pop the link to that in the description box. I'd really suggest before you watch the next video that you actually have a go at question two and see if you can work out the answer and then you'll be able to compare it to the quotations that I come up with. All right then, best of luck and as always, thanks for watching. Thanks to everybody who's given feedback on those Great Expectations videos. It really helps me to work out whether what I'm doing is helping you or not. So yes, thanks again. All right then, bye.